Hey, my name is Luke. Welcome to Baylor. This handsome dude is our pilot, Trevor. And if you're ready to go, we'll take you on a behind the scenes tour of Baylor's campus. So let's go. Tower to Bear Air 2, cleared for takeoff. Roger, Bear Air 2, on our way. Morning is a great time to see Baylor when the campus is just coming to life. We're headed up the Brazos River, past the Umphrey Law Center and the Mayborn Museum Complex. Just beyond is the Simpson Athletic Center, home to the most prestigious individual award in college football, the Heisman Trophy, won by Baylor's own Robert Griffin III, RG3. Straight ahead is our first stop of the day, the largest academic building on campus, the Baylor Sciences Building. Home to classrooms and over 150 teaching and research labs, the BSB is one of the premier university science facilities in the nation. Inside this building, it's incredible. Students voted the BSB's atrium their favorite place to study on campus, and the technology and instrumentation in the labs are state of the art. Research is big at Baylor, and it's not just for grad students and professors. I have friends working on cancer treatments, DNA coding, 2,000-year-old translations, and space exploration, working side by side with some of the leading research minds in the world. The chance to get that level of real-world, hands-on experience as an undergrad is pretty remarkable. And so are the classes. One of the things I love about Baylor is that the average class size is just 27 students. The largest class I've had was about 80 students. But even then, the professor knew all of our names. I actually had a class where it was just two other students, the professor and me, which turned out great. Just across the courtyard is one of my favorite places on campus, the McLean Student Life Center, or SLIC for short. It's like a fancy health club or gym that's available exclusively to the Baylor community. And the best part, it's free. I've arranged for a tour from my buddy, Lauren. Thanks, Luke. Welcome to the SLIC. My name is Lauren, this is Ross, and this is The Rock. It's a 53-foot high, freestanding rock wall with over 25 different top rope routes for beginner to advanced climbers. The Slick has seven indoor racquetball courts, four full-size basketball courts, an indoor jogging track, plus three levels of state-of-the-art exercise equipment. And after a workout, nothing hits the spot like a dip in the pool. You can head down the 16-foot water slide, float down the lazy river, or just kick back and relax in the hot tub. Baylor has an active campus, and intramurals are a great way to get out, get your heart pumping, and have fun. Each year, thousands of students turn out to compete in everything from the traditional to the unique. And because you can compete with people at your own school level, you don't have to worry about being a great athlete like Spider Woman here. To have a great time. Well, it's time for us to be headed to our next stop. But with all that exercise, I could use a break. Hey, Trev, any suggestions where we could grab a bite on the way? Roger. Fair Air 2, diverting to Moody to refuel. The coffee shop in Moody Memorial Library's All Britain Foyer is one of the largest and most popular student hangouts on campus. But everywhere you look, there are lots of unique places with great food and a chance to wind down, catch up, or just carve out some quiet time. One of my favorites is Common Grounds a laid-back little coffee shop next to campus. It's an old converted house with some funky furniture. And on the weekends, you can hang out and catch some great live music. Baylor has lots of places where you can explore and appreciate some of the more cultural aspects of campus. Sky, you're a theater arts major. What can you tell us about the programs here? Well, Luke, I'm standing on the stage of the magnificent Maybe Theater in Hooper Shaper Fine Arts Center, home to Baylor's programs for visual arts and theater. Baylor's theater department is ranked among the top 20 undergraduate programs in the nation, with students putting on about five to seven productions per calendar year. If music's your thing, there's always a recital, choir, or orchestral concert on campus. Baylor has full-time resident faculty for just about any instrument you can think of, plus an entire department for vocal studies. For you guys, the theater and concerts here make for a great date. You can pull off sophistication without putting a hurt on your wallet. And if your tastes are a little more free-spirited, the university brings some of the biggest national caliber acts to campus every year. 
This is just a small taste of the Baylor campus, which to me is the most exciting in the country. Since there's a lot more to take in, make sure you jump on over to the other tours. Each is totally different. And then, when you think you've seen it all, come see it for yourself. To schedule a visit, apply for admission, or check your admission status, click on Go Baylor. Bear Air 2, bearing 150, returning to base. We look forward to seeing you on campus, in person, real soon.